Hello, you're welcome. How to solve this nice exponential equation solution from here. What we have here, it is 2 raised to power x times 2 raised to power x times 2 raised to power x equals to 30. This follows when we have a times a times a. And write this as a raised to power 3. And this also here we have 2 raised to power x raised to power 3 equals to 30 here. Then this follows the law of logarithm indices. When we have a raised to power n, a raised to power n. When we have this, we have a raised to power m. That is, this power multiplies, and we have 2 raised to power 3x equals to 30 on this side. Then, here we take the log on both sides. Here we have log 2 raised to power 3x equals to log. 30 on this side. Then here we apply the power of log here. When we have log m raised to power p, this is the same thing as p log m. At this here we have 3 hex log 2 equals to log 30 on this side. At this next step, we divide both sides by log 2. At this divide this side by log 2. Also, divide this side by log 2. Here we have log 2 cancelled each other. And we are left with 3 hex here, which is equal to log 30 over log 2. Then, from what we have here, we can factor 2 from 30 and we write 30 as 2 times 15. Then, here this becomes 3 hex equals to log 2 times 15 over log 2. Then, this follows the law of logarithm when we have log a times b. This can be expressed as log a plus log b. Then, what we have here, follow this, and we have 3 hex equals to log 2 plus log 15 over log 2 then next step here we separate this into two fractions and we have 3 hex equals to log 2 over log 2 plus log 15 over log 2 which implies here we have log 2 cancel each other, 1 left here. That is 3 hex now equals to 1 plus log 15 over log 2. Then, next step here also 15 can be written as 3 times 5. That is here we have 3 hex equals to 1 plus log 3 times 5 over log 2. Then this also follows the law of logarithm and we have 3 hex equals to 1 plus log 3 plus log 5 over log 2. Then here we separate this into two fractions. And we have 3 hex equals to 1 plus log 3 over log 2 plus log 5 over log 2. Then from here, we apply change of this. And we have log A over log B. This is the same thing as log a to base b. But this what we have becomes 3 hex equals to 1 plus log 3 base 2 plus log 5 base 2. And here we divide both sides by 3. So this divide this side by 3. Also divide this side by 3. Here 3 cancel each other. And this becomes x equals to 1 plus 
log 3 base 2 plus log 5 base 2 all over 3. That is the value of x here. We have x equals to 1 plus log 3 base 2 plus 5 base 2 all over 3. Let's check here. If we satisfy this given problem, that is, we substitute the value of x here, which is x equals to 1 plus log 3 is 2 plus log 5 is 2 all over 3. Then this here becomes 2 raised to power 1 plus log 3 base 2 plus log 5 base 2 all over 3 times also 2 raised to power 1 plus log 3 base 2 plus log 5 base 2 all over 3 also times 2 raised to power 1 plus log 3 base 2 plus log 5 base 2 all over 3. Is it equals to 30 on this side? That is, when we have C base multiplying, like when we have A raised to power M times A raised to power M times A raised to power M, we can have the power, right? we have A raised to power 3 M. Also here, we have 2 raised to power 3 times 1 plus log 3 base 2 plus log 5 base 2 all over 3. Is it equals to 30 on this side? That is, here we have this power multiplies 3 here cancel each other. This becomes 2 raised to power 1 plus log 3 base 2 plus log 5 base 2 is it equals to 30 on this side then we apply the law of indices when we have a raised to power hand plus n and separate this as a raised to power hand times a raised to power hand and this becomes 2 raised to power 1 times 2 raised to power log 3 base 2 times 2 raised to power log 5 base 2 is it equals to 30 on this side this 2 raised to power 1, that's 2, times this follows when we have a raised to power log b to base a, which is equals to b. That is here, we have 3, and times 5, is it equals to 30 on this side. And 2 times 3, that's 6, 6 times 5, that's 30, which is equals to 30 here. That is left hand side, equals to the right hand side. And therefore, we conclude that x equals to 1 plus log 3 base 2 plus log 5 base 2 all over 3. Satisfy this given problem. And thank you for watching. Don't forget these steps. Subscribe for more videos and turn the notification bell. Share this video, give it a thumbs up, and put your comment. See you next class and bye for now.